Hey guys, uh, this is Nirmal for Technique.com, and today we'll see how to create a system restore point on uh, Windows 8. Uh, so, um, since uh, there is a change in the start screen for Windows 8, so we'll describe the simple steps to create a system restore point on your uh, Windows 8. So, now once you're in the start uh, screen, uh, you can just type on the start screen uh, control panel. So there you go we are typed our control panel now here uh, select the control panel so this will open the control panel now in the search bar in the uh, control panel type uh, system restore so you can see i have typed our uh, system restore so you can see create a uh, restore point option so click this option now this will option open the system properties tab uh, you can see the option uh, system restore and also the uh, drives which are enabled with the protection for system restore so you can uh, enable from here now when if you want to create a system restore point instantly just click this create button so this will uh, ask you to create a restore point uh, so you can type a description to specify the restore point so let's uh, type uh, test then now let's create so it's now instantly creating system restore point so this will take some time uh, based on uh, the amount of files or uh, the system performance you have so let's uh, wait for the system to create the restore point Okay, now it says uh, the restore point was uh, created successfully. So that's uh, that's the system create uh, restore point has now been created. Now, whenever you have a, have a situation where the PC is not working properly or some drivers have messed up with your few system files and you want to do a system restore, you can easily uh, restore from your earlier system restore points. For that, uh, you have this option. You follow the same process and to get this to the system protection tab and you can see system restore option here click on this option and you can see restore system uh, files and settings restore uh, system restore can help uh, fix problem that might be taking your computer run slowly or stop responding so system restore does not affect any of the documents pictures or other personal data recently installed programs and drivers might be uninstalled so if you have uh, installed any app uh, which was um, installed after this restore, restore, restore point was created then that app might be deleted and also the settings of that app uh, similarly the drivers installed after you have created the system restore point will also be deleted so now let's uh, click next and you can see the options uh, restore points created one was uh, created uh, on uh, fe February 5th or now one is created on February 7th so you can see this uh, this is created with the Windows update and this was created manually that's the one we created right now now you can see uh, once you uh, once you select the update whichever restore point you want you can see scan f affected programs that means uh, whenever you do this uh, restore which all programs are affected by this uh, restore restoration that can be scanned for uh, f using this option so now when you have selected um, the restore point click next and you will you complete your computer will be restored to the state it was before even in the description field below so this will be uh, rest uh, restored if you have changed your windows password recently we recommend you to create a password dis reset disk so in case you have changed the password this might be causing the restoration point uh, affecting the restoration point so you need to have the password uh, if you if you do have changed it uh, recently you need to know the password uh, before it was uh, uh, p when you created the restore point so this will also restart your PC so make sure you have saved all the work now when you click finish it will start restoring your PC to your older state uh, where it was working fine so that's how you uh, create a restore point as well as uh, restore this PC to your older system restore point so that's all guys thanks for watching the video and if you have any queries on this uh, uh, do drop a comment I will be glad to help you out thanks for watching the video and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for all the latest updates